what is up? So today we wanted to show you guys our dining room table that just got delivered. Um, it was inspired by Beetlejuice, of course, orchestrated and designed by my wonderful fiance, Moses. Um, so yeah, this is our table. I've been dreaming of a Beetlejuice dining room for so long. Like since we met, I've been wanting the Beetlejuice statues and the Beetlejuice table. And this is real stone. Would you like to describe the stone husband, future husband? <laughs> <laughs> it's only granite. It's like a really like four inches of solid stone. It took like 10 people to bring it in here. They have a live edge in the movie. They have exactly this shape, the live edge here. And then we made an iron base for it because this thing is heavier than anything you've ever seen in your life. So my favorite part is these chairs, like they're literally so perfect. You can see we have our little guests right here, but you can slide them out. They're exactly the same as the movie. And they're nice and sturdy. I was kind of worried that the chairs would be like, not no. sturdy for my Say big thing. Same thing, iron. <laughs> is it? Is it made out of iron? Yeah. Okay, let me show you the details of the back of these. All right, and then the back of the chairs has this rope where each of the thing was individually attached, which that was super cool, and this is, the cable from the wide angle. And it's just really, really long as you can tell. Like I'm just gonna throw myself into the equation here. It's super, super big. How many feet? <laughs> oh my God, this is actually, how many feet? I know, <laughs> it literally is like a shit fashion. Yeah. Oh my God, okay, how, how many feet is this? It's like 10 feet long and four feet wide. And how heavy is this? I know, it took 10 guys to lift just the table top. Literally 10, but it's so, like, if you sit at it, like, you don't have to worry about flipping it over. Like, I just always put my thing and I, like, think I flip no, it over. No, it's impossible. But it's, it is light enough that it won't go through. Like, if you have dining room on the, right? Like, it won't fall through the thing. Well, we're on the ground floor here. So. Oh, just kidding. A little dog scrappy, so so we have our little timber inspired. The most difficult thing about making this, it, it took a long, it took a while. Yeah, I mean, it, it wasn't. It just there's a lot of moving parts. There's the metal, there's the fur, there's the base, the stone. A solid stone. What is this stone again? <laughs> to find the stone like this is hard. That's hard. It's huge. It's like a huge shot. But what I love is the detail of it too. I'll come show you guys. Because in the movie, they had this. This was like a very defined thing where it's like almost like if it was styrofoam or what. But the fact, did they chisel it to make it this shape? Yeah, this was whole handmade. Like in the movie, it's fake. It's not real stone. It's probably uh. like wood that was painted to look like stone. But this is real stone. Yeah, I thought maybe it would be like styrofoam. This is like a real slab of stone. And they had to like hand break it and give the shape and then smooth out the edges and everything. It looks so amazing. And we do have a full... So obviously this is just the beginning, the foundation of our Beetlejuice dining room. The table and the chairs were most important. The statues came first. We were really lucky to get those. So those have been kind of sitting here for a while. And then the table took about maybe like six to seven months because it was a custom table. Um, we also have glass brick coming. So it's going to be like the movie, glass brick. Um, and we're going to kind of just try to recreate the entire thing. Our whole house is thematic. Cinematic thematic, I guess you could say it's all very movie based um, And yeah, my last room was a Beetlejuice room, but it was just like green and purple and stripes. This is like a classy version of It's a one-to-one -one replica of the movie. Mm hmm And while it's Halloween time now, like we kind of dress up all year and we're kind of Halloween-y all year So um, I don't think we'll ever get sick of this and it's kind of classic and even in the movie that dining room scene that dining room the furniture that Delia created was just like masterpiece and yeah, very lucky that we both get to like be creative with it. This is my favorite thing. I was so impressed when it came. Any other notes about the table? Because this is really cool. Um, no, soon we'll have a classic dinner like in the movie and that will be fun. <laughs> Then from the minute I met Moses, he said he did custom furniture and he would show me these huge tables. And I literally was like, can you build me Beetlejuice furniture? And who knew? That was literally the first month of us meeting. I was like yeah. dead serious and like, who knew? Okay, our caterers are coming in, so <laughs> we're gonna let them in. And one final thing we have to do at this table, do you know? No. <laughs> day. Misa day. 
Daylight coming and we want to go home. Day means a day. Oh. Daylight coming and we want to go home. Guys, this has, might be my favorite dream come true, as if you didn't make all my dreams come true, but this is the most amazing thing ever. I am obsessed with it, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys want to see more home decor as it comes, like we are customizing everything. Obviously, my fiance is a furniture builder, so obviously we're gonna have everything customized, so it's like a little Moses Hoffman showcase, but if you guys wanna see more pieces as they come in, let us know, or if you just wanna wait for the full thing to be done, and if you wanna see the dining room when it's fully done, when we get the paint, the glass brick, and all the other um, architecture stuff in here, let us know just by thumbs up in this video when they get a lot of views, I'm like, okay, let's do it. I see the house tours do well, so if you guys wanna see more house to home things, let us know. And yeah, I hope you guys have a really great Halloween if you're seeing this before Halloween. And if not, I hope you're just having a great year because this is just us all year. Anyway. <laughs> so love you guys. And um, yeah, let us know what room you want to see next. Bye. <laughs>